Good morning. Um, I look like a hot mess and I'm sitting in my car and I have the AC on and you can probably hear it and it's probably distracting and I probably don't care. Um, ever since I got out of school, like a month ago, three weeks ago, I've been sitting in my room doing nothing. Literally just watching TV and watching YouTube. Watching other YouTubers do stuff and I haven't been doing anything. So here I am. I actually got up and I got dressed kind of. And we're gonna go do stuff. I don't know what stuff we're doing yet. Um, cause I don't plan my videos or plan my days at all. Uh, so yeah, I look disgusting. Um, but yeah, if you have nothing else to do, just like me, then uh, stick around and we can uh, enjoy our day together. Which sunglasses should I wear? Okay, should I wear these? Michael Kors, they're kind of bougie a little bit. Kind of feel like Catwoman. Or, uh, or I have these big boy glasses. They're big, round, and pink. And they cover more of my face, so that's always a plus. I think I'm gonna go with the black ones. I don't know, these ones kind of feel greasy. Um, I got Starbucks, as always. Even though, <laughs> here's the thing about Starbucks. It's convenient. It's like when you haven't eaten breakfast it, before school and then you go through the McDonald's drive through It's like that. Because I have four Starbucks, I think, within like 10 minutes of my house. So like, it's just so convenient to get to like, of course, I love small coffee shops and I support small coffee shops much more than Starbucks. I don't like the Starbucks brand or like what they stand for. Um, so like in my heart, like I don't wanna give them money unless you wanna like sponsor me because money can change anything. All my opinions can be changed with money. But, uh, <laughs> but of course like I support small businesses and I love small businesses, especially small town coffee shops and their coffee's better. I like it much more, but there's not like good ones nearby. Like I'd have to drive like a half hour to get to the good ones. There's like a couple close by, but like they're kind of like ungodly, ungodly, un they're very expensive and or they don't have soy milk and I need soy milk or else like I will have explosions later on. So yeah, that's why I get Starbucks every day. Stop coming for me, okay? I support small businesses, I swear. So now I don't know where we're going. I don't know what to do. I don't, I, I'm about to just drive because I don't know what else to do. So um, enjoy this driving montage that I'm about to create for you. So here's the deal. I have this like cemetery that I uh, like to come to a lot because it's usually really quiet and there's never anyone really here. And I can kind of just like come here to like clear my mind and stuff. 
but um today they're mowing everywhere there's like one two at least four giant mowers out here uh and they kind of just keep looking at me so i haven't even gotten out of my car yet and i feel anxious so that's where i'm at right now uh i don't know this kind of ruined my plan because i was gonna come out here and just talk and uh now i'm have company so that's where i'm at right now i don't know what to do i'm awkward i just wanna i just wanna hide uh so uh, change of plans um apparently there's a funeral going on and uh i was at the cemetery today we're going to so uh yeah don't know why they were mowing though if there was a funeral like about to they were like coming into the cemetery and i had to like it was a one-way road so i had to like drive on in the grass to get around all them oh my god this the anyways um uh, i found this thrift store in this town like i'm kind of in i'm out of the way i'm like in this like really small like rundown town like a little bit outside of like where i live it's probably like a half hour away so i'm just gonna go to this thrift store and try to make this trip worthwhile since i drove all the way out here and gas is freaking expensive these days so we're gonna try and find something to do because uh i'm not about wasting money so here we go Okay, well, um, I thought that was a thrift store, but um, it was more like an antique shop, sort of. So, I bought two things because they were kind of cheap, but they also looked kind of cool. I don't know what I'm going to do with them, but uh, I'm a hoarder, so I'll probably just shove them in my room and forget about them. Uh, so, this is a barometer, and it said that it works. Like, it's supposed to be... A working barometer. Uh, don't know what I'm going to do with it. But uh, I have it now. I have a barometer. And I also bought... Oh, she wrapped it up all nice. And I'm just going to tear it apart. Oh yeah, the barometer was $5.00. And then I bought this for a dollar. It says chocolate soldier. So, um, also don't know what I'm gonna do with this, but I have a cup that says chocolate soldier. Well, it's kind of like ceramic, but um, I have it now. Uh, was this worth the trip out here? You tell me. Comment down below if this was worth the trip out here. Uh, I don't think it was. But I'm going to convince myself that it was so I don't cry myself to sleep tonight about wasting so much gas. Uh, I don't know what else I'm going to do today. Uh, I'm out a half hour and I could just go home and watch TV. But that would be every single other day and I'm trying to be productive today uh it's not really going well but the day's not over so i'm gonna keep trying let's just keep driving and see if we run into anything else appealing let's go okay so i just went into kroger and i like bought a ton of groceries like a bunch of fruit and stuff whatever a bunch of healthy junk to eat for lunch and um like the watermelon i scanned like two packs of like uh diced watermelon like i scanned them and then they said like place item aside or something like that for both of them like both of them like it didn't scan them and, like i mean it scanned them but it didn't show up their price so i just placed them into a bag because i figured like 
I don't know. I don't know what the problem was. Like, sometimes it says you can place items, like, in a bag or in the cart, like, with water bottles. So, I was just like, eh, it's whatever. And then I scanned the rest of my stuff. And then I got to, like, the pay screen. And then it just goes, help is on the way. And I was like, um, why is help on the way? I don't know what I did. Is it the watermelon? Like, what did I do? So, some guy came over and he literally just put his passcode in and then it just let me pay and leave. And, well, oh, no, no, no. It said something like extra items in bagging area or something. And I was like, oh my God, are these like watermelon? Like, am I not paying for them? So, um, then I just paid and I left and I'm pretty sure I didn't pay for the watermelon. It's like $6. So I kind of cheated them $6, but like it wasn't on purpose. Like I tried to scan them and pay for them, but like it just didn't let me scan them. And then the guy just let me pay for the rest of the stuff. So like, does that count as stealing? I accidentally stole watermelon. I didn't mean to, like I had full intentions of paying, but like it didn't let me pay. Is that my fault? Like, did I steal? Am I a thief? Am I, am I a bad person? Like, is that a sin? Like, should I, <laughs> should I go in there and give them $6? Like, I don't know. Like, I feel kind of bad. Like I have, I don't steal. Like I've never stolen in my life. So, um, I don't know. I hope that doesn't like, uh, lengthen my time period in purgatory. Like, I don't know if that's going to be weighted on my soul. I don't know. Whatever. I'm going to go home and eat them and then maybe it'll, uh, cleanse my soul. Uh, all right. I'm sorry. Okay. Well, that's all I got for you today. Um, I tried to be productive. I ended up doing nothing and spending unnecessary money. So, um, the rest of the summer is probably going to be spent in my bed. Um, but if you for some reason like that, or if you for some reason like me, make sure to give this a thumbs up and subscribe down below. It really means a lot. It helps a lot. It really kind of boosts my self-esteem because right now it's at like negative thousand. So every subscription just, yeah, just brings it up a little bit. Um, if you got this far, thanks for watching. Here's the video shout out of the day. I might have one. I don't really know. If I don't, then I'll just put a random picture right here. Uh, make sure to retweet my tweet at A-Y-Y-E-E, -E, it's Casey. Retweet the tweet about this video and you could be the next video shout out whenever the next video comes out. Who knows when that's gonna be. Um, all right. I'm gonna go eat stolen watermelon. See you next time.